if you had to do it all over again? Oh, I'd do it the same. Wouldn't change a thing. If I could have it all to do over, I'd do it the same. And I, it all comes back to that I have the greatest. I have the greatest. The greatest family in the world. As far as I'm concerned, it's the very greatest. I have no kids. There could be no kids any greater than my kids. And I've had such a great life. My wife is, she's been the, the stone, of, what do you call it, the, of my life. She's, she's helped me so many times. And <laughs> If I could make them happy, that's that's what I wanted to do. Just make them happy and make them feel like they've been lost all their problems and cares, and they're just having a good time and living it up. And life is wonderful for them. And it's been a great life for me. And I know I have the best family in the world. These kids are wonderful. There's nobody could have had a better family. And it's just, just a wonderful thing. I've never met a fellow I didn't like. I like everybody. I love everybody. And we're all like one. We're all made like one together. And we all, uh, you know, we got to understand that we all got to communicate and be one. Of course, being from home myself, I was kind of like Will Rogers was. I never met a man I didn't like, or a woman either, especially a good-looking girl. <laughs> This is a picture here of my beautiful wife that she made uh, the year we were married. In fact, she made it before we were married. Were married. And she's still as beautiful today as she was then. And uh, I thought the most beautiful girl in the world, when I saw her singing in a choir in church, uh, I asked a friend uh, who she was and asked where she went to church. And I changed my church and started going to her church. And of course, I was playing in the band, the church church band, which helped some too, because uh, being a musician, that helped me out. It wasn't my good looks, because I never had that. But I walked up to her and I said, how would you like to go out and get some ice cream? She said, okay. So she walked away and, uh, and the six guys standing around her thought, what happened? What happened here? Who is this guy? And uh, so it made me feel very important. I figured, I thought it was a very good challenge for me to be able to, uh, to start going with her. And about six months later, we got married. And, uh, and now we have uh, uh, grandkids, I have great grandkids. And uh, we, we had four, four kids. And then I had Connie which was five for me, and we'll be married 58 years, the 13th of September. And it seems like I've been married all my life. But there she is. All my success I, I give to her. We are
standing on the corner. Talk, she's getting to talk oh, to. She's getting to speak to. I know. Don't say anything. Do it easy. Don't tell her we've been how old we are. Don't tell her we've been married 58 years. Cause is this no, also? Nobody believes. Is this oral? Oil. Yeah. What do you mean? It will talk. Oil check. Oil checks in the mail. Lynn, I'm through. I'm through. I'm through. Now this is Christmas picture. Hurry up, we'll go to sleep. Oh, Lang Syne. 